Hey guys, it's Kylie, and in today's video, we're doing Remy's Hide and Squeak. So for food and wine, one of the things you can do is Remy's Hide and Squeak. It is the map with the different stickers on the back, and you're finding Remy with different like vegetables and condiments and different things. Um, so I picked up one of these maps, and we're gonna go through all the different countries. Some of it's actually really based on the different booths. So we have like the refreshment outpost, and some of these other ones that aren't countries. They're more like the actual booth. Um, so we're going to go around and try to find all these different ones and there's a few different prizes. You can get their little cups um, and I'm going to show you what prize I get at the end. I'm excited to give this a try. I like doing these for each one of the festivals. I think they're fun. So I'm going to give this a try and I'll show you where all the different um, Remy's are in all of our different locations. So there is France's Remy and it is the eggplant. So we're going to put our eggplant for our first sticker. So for our map that we're in France and we're going to put the eggplants, I'm just going to flip it over and I'm pulling off that eggplant sticker because that's the first one we see and then we are going to take that and we are going to put that on France and we have our first one done. We're just going to kind of go through and do whichever ones we can while we and then we might ride some rides and then go back to this. We're just playing it around but we got our first sticker. So this is the apple seed orchard one and it's before you even go in it's he's on top and Remy's got the pan so that's the one we're going to be doing. So we're taking our sticker, taking that pan sticker, and we're going to flip it over and we put it on our apple seed orchard. I'm not very good at putting the stickers on. And there we go. We got our second one done and now we're going to go through some of these other different locations. So in Canada, this is the Remy. He's on top, like in the pavilion, he's on top of the roof and he has the bread. So we're going to put our bread sticker for Canada. So here is Canada, and we're going to take our bread sticker, putting our bread sticker on the front, and it is going on Canada. They're starting to get the uh, jammers are making some noise, but we got that on Canada. So we got three of them done, and we're on our way. We're going to do refreshment post. I did see that one before. We're going to do refreshment port next, and then work our way around. This is one for refreshment port. It's got tea and herbs, so that's what the next sticker is going to be. You can see that's our herbs right there, and we're going to put that as our sticker for refreshment port. So I pulled off the sticker of the herbs, and that is for refreshment port, so I'm just going to stick that on right here. And then we have our next one, um, and then Australia is actually right behind us, so I'm going to look for that one next, because uh, we're actually right in front of Australia, so we're going to search for uh, that one. And we can actually see it right up on top of the booth. You can see he looks like he's got an, looks like, of garlic, I think, based on that. We've got some garlic, and that's on top of the Australia booth. So if you zoom out, there's the Australia booth. He's right on top, and it looks like he's got some garlic. So I'm just going to do that sticker as well. There's a couple of them that are like right on top of each other. Um, these ones are definitely all like right on top of each other. So we're going to just grab. They don't exactly go in order. Like the Canada one was actually in between um, apple seed or like apple seed order was after the Canada one. Um, so they don't go in perfect order, but you do have, this map does show kind of like where they are in the country, which is nice. So we're going to put on, I think that's garlic, on to Australia. And then I'm going to move over and we're going to skip Hawaii because that's actually farther down. And we're going to go to Arthies. Looking more at it, we actually think that um, Australia is the onion. So I'm going to switch that. And if we happen to see later whether it's onion or garlic, we'll definitely know when we find the other one. And we're going to actually switch it to the onion. So flipping this over, I'm actually going to peel off the garlic one. And we're going to switch it to the onion. So I switched it to the onion sticker. It didn't come off very easy. But I'm going to just stick our garlic sticker back on the back so that we have it for later when we find whichever booth is garlic. See, I kind of ripped it a little bit, but just sticking that back on the back so we have it for later when we find which booth is actually garlic. It, it was a white onion where they showed a red onion, so that was the only reason I thought it was the other way around, but we're going to say it's the onion. So for Earth Eats, we have Remy and the carrot, so we're going to take off our carrot one and we're going to use that for Earth Eats with the sweaty looks like. We'll say the um, Remy's look like they've been definitely used for a couple years. Um, and some of the stuff isn't as vibrant as the stickers, but still pretty cool to see. So we're going to take our carrot sticker off, get our carrot sticker, and we're going to flip 
this over and we're actually at Earth Eats. We're skipping over Hawaii for right now and putting it right there. So that's the Remy on the Hawaii. Um, it's on top of the Hawaii booth. And it looks like it's got like the balsamic or oil, which I can't tell exactly which it is. Um, but that's the sticker we're gonna put, but he's up on the top of it. So I'm just pulling out the sticker. And it goes on Hawaii. And my map does already have the stamp. I did pick up my thing already just because it was easier to pick it up. Uh, we were already shopping, so I picked it up when we were shopping. Um, but I will show you it at the end. But we have a couple more to go. Just like where we were coming in and out. I knew it was easier to pick it up at the time. So we have kind of like half a world showcase to go and we're going to complete our map. So this is where Mexico's is. It's actually on top. Um, there's the restaurant up there. It has actually the summer squash. So that's our next one on our map up on the top. So then on the back. So this is our sticker. I'm just going to peel it off. I have a hard time peeling these off one handed. And then I flip it over and this goes on to Mexico. We got our next one complete. In China, this one is actually pretty hard to find. It's on the side of China, so it's kind of in the bushes on the side. And it is Remy with the pepper grinder. Um, so there's the China show. It's kind of on the side. You don't notice it because it's hiding behind this rock. So definitely a hard one to find, but it's right over here. And we're going to put our pepper grinder on our sticker. So we got our pepper grinder sticker. And I'm just going to take it and we're going to put it on China as part of our map. So for the refreshment, um, this is the refreshment outpost. It's actually on top. It's hard to hear with all the kids drumming. But this one is garlic, which means the other one was onion. So it was a good thing we switched that. Um, so we're going to add our sticker to our next part on our map. So right, refreshment outpost is where we're putting this. I'm just going to take our garlic sticker. Um, and we're going to add that to our map. Just gonna make sure this one sticks where I had used it before. And that is our map so far. We have five more locations. So here is Germany's. It is the oil. Um, there's the entrance to the restaurant in Germany. So we have Remy with the oil. And then I'm gonna go to this table. And we're gonna flip over. And we are going to grab our oil. So we'll say you can peel off the stickers on the back. It's just on like the sticker sheet, but I just find it easier to leave it on there. But they do sometimes are a little hard to take off. Well, we got the oil. We're putting that on Germany, and we only have a few more to go. Um, but this so far has been fun. Some of them are definitely harder to hunt for, so it's definitely a game. Some of the other ones I feel like haven't been as much like as hard to hunt for. But some of these are in the country. Some of these are just at booths. There's a lot. Um, they definitely make some hard and some easier, so so far it's been pretty fun. So in Italy, it's right over the entrance to Viennapoli, and it's Remy up there with the tomatoes, perfect for Italy, and we're going to put our tomato sticker. But he's right on top of the entrance to Viennapoli. He's pretty high up there, so he's hard to see, um, but I saw him from a distance that he was way on the top. So we're going to take our tomato sticker, and we're going to put it on top of Italy, and we got three more to go. Um, but this has been super fun, and we got these last three. We got zucchini, we got pepper, and we have salt. So we're now in America at Hops and Barley, and on top is Remy with the peppers. So that is our next sticker. We got Remy with our peppers. So we're gonna flip over, and we're gonna peel off our pepper sticker. So we got our pepper sticker, and we're gonna flip that back over and add it to Hops and Barley. And then we're down to our final two. In Japan, Remy has some zucchini. He's up by the quick service restaurant in Japan. But he's got his zucchini. We're going to add that as our second to last one on our map. Um, so I put the zucchini on. I was talking to somebody, so I didn't show it. But I got the zucchinis. Took the stick off the back, and we put it on. And we got one last one, which is grease. So we know grease is going to be salt. Um, but I still will show you where it is. So here is Greece, and this is our last one. We got Remy on the top with the salt shakers, and he's right on top of the Greece booth. This is in between Morocco and Japan. So we're going to take our last sticker, which is salt, and we're gonna pull off the salt, flip it over, and put our final sticker of Remy on our Greece. 
and there we go our map is complete and we got all the different things I do like for this one that that's random um, I know for festival of the arts it wasn't really random it was kind of obvious which ones were going where but it's kind of random which I like and it was definitely hard to find some and some were a lot easier like the ones that were on festival booths were a little bit easier but super fun to complete. So I just wanted to finish um, off our map. So we finished it at Epcot. It's actually, we're now back at the resort. We ended up watching the fireworks. I never got time to finish this video, but I wanted to show you off our prize. I will show you, um, this is all the four prizes you can get. So you pick one of the four cups. Uh, I think they have some fun designs. We decided to go with the bell one. Um, so it's bell and then you rotate it. It's got Lumi here. And she's serving up some food and then you rotate it and it has the same design on it four different uh three different times so it's a nice little storage cup um it's just like a hard plastic material so i wouldn't recommend like dishwashing or anything but it's great to like store stuff in um so i think it's a great cup but i hope you guys enjoyed this remy's hide and squeak it was definitely a super fun activity to do uh, i definitely think some were hard some were easy i had a great time doing it um there was a lot of kids running around doing it too which was fun to watch um, but always fun to do these little scavenger hunts. I like them at each festival. I've now done I think one at almost every festival I don't know if I've done if they even have one at festival of the holidays I think that might be the only one I haven't done But um, I've done a little bit of all the different festival ones, which are so much fun um, I always like doing them and they're not that expensive It's like ten dollars or so to do and you do get a prize plus you get a lot of fun in the park trying to find all the different things but i hope you guys enjoyed this video subscribe if you want to see more disney videos on this channel like this video if you enjoyed and definitely check out all the other videos i'm going to have from my trip um definitely some awesome vlogs we're only here for a couple days it was only a quick three-day trip so not a ton of vlogs but a couple vlogs um plus we are staying in a different resort so i'll have a room tour so definitely check out all of that if you're interested in more disney content but I hope you guys enjoyed watching and I will see you guys later.